With football starting up and hopefully cooler weather on the way, I think it's safe to say tis the season for rice. September is rice month, so we're taking a closer look at the Checkoff program, which funds research and promotion efforts that support their industry. This week, Twilas Carl Wiggers visits with a farmer in St. Landry Parish who says he would not still be in the business without that program. Just north of Eunice, Michael Fruge is cutting his final fields of rice for this year's crop. Unfortunately, this crop has not been a great one for Fruge to bring in. This is some later rice we planted that we're harvesting now. Uh, we are about to wrap up the season. Uh, unfortunately, it has been one of the worst rice crops we've cut in, in a very long time. Fruge says that tough years like this are the years that he sees the greatest value in what his checkoff dollars are helping fund. That checkoff dollar is actually pennies. The Louisiana rice industry collects a five and three cent per hundred weight assessment to fund research and promotion efforts respectively through the Louisiana Rice Research Board and the Louisiana Rice Promotion Board. Fruge says with that investment, he sees a great return. There's things that we spend a lot more money on that, that you don't see the, the amount of return that we get from research and promotion. Uh, you know, we, we spend a lot of money on, on different things in life that you never see a return for. We spend money on research and promotion and see a return. And these checkoff funds are a big part of it. Without that, I don't know if there's a Louisiana rice industry. You know, I think it's daddy central for us. Kane Fontenot is the chair of the Louisiana Rice Promotion Board. He is part of the volunteer board of rice farmers who is funding projects to promote Louisiana rice to the consumers they are helping to feed. The uh, promotion board plays a big part in that. It's as far as educating the people on uh, that we do grow high quality rice. We grow affordable rice. Uh, and it's just a matter of communicating it to the people because not everyone knows that. While Fruge has contributed to the checkoff programs throughout his career, he says his eyes were open to the value of that promotion dollar when he started his own packaged rice brand, Parish Rice. I did not understand the value until I started doing what I'm doing um, with my own packaged rice business and interacting with the consumers the way I do now. Um, I think those promotion dollars are more valuable than I ever dreamed of. Fruge and Fontenot, as individual farmers, can only do so much. The entire Louisiana rice industry working together is what makes this promotion effort so valuable. Because of what it costs, I could only reach a certain amount of people. If we have this collective coming from our industry, from everyone involved, you could reach a broader geography. You could reach a lot bigger area and a lot more people. You're always stronger as a team, right? The individual can only do so much. So the more we pull together and the more we work as, the more we work as one, it's, uh, it, it creates a lot more strength and a bigger footprint. It helps us all. In St. Landry Parish, I'm Carl Wiggers for This Week in Louisiana Agriculture. To learn more about the Louisiana Rice Promotion Board, head over to our website at twilighttv.org. Also, as you plan your dinner tonight, consider making rice a part of it.